What is up, my beautiful best friends? What's new? If you're new to my channel, what is up? My name is Mal. It is great to meet you. I sound a little sick. I've just been working a lot. I've died to... Moving is a lot of work and school and just everything. <laughs> it's a lot, but I'm learning a lot, learning to balance it. If you didn't know, I always wear a hoodie in a QA. and I don't know why I say that, and I feel the need to point it out. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I tweeted a while ago for you guys to ask me <laughs> some questions that I can answer because I have not done a Q&A in so long. I honestly try to do one at least once a month, but that just did not work out at all. But I'm gonna try again. We're gonna... We're gonna keep trying till I get it. Or at least just more Q&As. I feel like for me, that's how you guys get to see like what's happening in my life, what's new in my life. I need to update you guys on my life. I've been slacking and I'm back to do so. Let me know what's new in your life. Comment down below if a asshole has broken your heart because send me his at and I will. I'll tell him what's up. Um, or if just you're doing good school, I don't know. Just let me know how you're doing. I honestly care. I do care and I'll read your comments unless they're hate comments. Don't read those. So I got a lot of questions asking about my house. I'll insert some of them here. But like, how is it living alone? Am I loving my new house? How's the crib? <laughs> Marley, I love you. <laughs> what am I most excited about my house? Things like that. I don't know. I just, I wanted to talk a minute about the house situation because I didn't do that great of a job in the last thing. I talked about it in my last video, but I am leasing. I'm only gonna be in this house for like a year or something. It's not my house. It's not like brand new at all. It's been around for a very long time, but I love it. It's like so me. It's kind of crazy. The view, just the layout, I'm kind of obsessed. So I just feel like it was meant to happen because it happened so quick and like it just gives me really good vibes and it wasn't vibes that I was getting in my apartment and my apartment like literally living there just like made me not my best because it was just it wasn't enough space and I wasn't one to like go out on like you know adventures by myself all day like I was staying home and working whatever it was like suffocating me and here I feel like almost like freer and like I get to see you know an amazing view half the time my other view was like train tracks and my neighbors so I'm feeling very blessed about this um it worked out perfectly it's kind of crazy that's when I really think things in life are meant to be when they work out like too perfect for it's like what like how did that happen do you know what i mean but i don't know it's amazing right now i have so much more to do and there's so much like upkeep with the house honestly what i'm most excited about is like using this space for just everything i want to do i i mean duh i have so many plans about merch and well not even merch maybe clothing just hold up, just wait. I feel like there's just so much more I can do here. I'm gonna film so many videos. I'm really excited as you can tell and I'm really hoping you guys are too. This is just not to brag. You guys are sharing this with me. Like I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you guys. Like I wouldn't want to be living on my own at this age if it wasn't for my position, you know? Like I'm not gonna address the hate to it because I easily could, but it doesn't make sense. I'm someone that likes to live in the now and do what I want and just see what happens in life. I think the way we live our life is kind of stupid, not to lie. Not stupid, but you know, like it's very laid out for us and I don't agree with that. I like to make my own life and my own path and not, you know, follow every system the government and the world has trained us to do. I'm on a rant, holy f but let me know any videos you guys want to see here because there's so much more I can do and I'm so excited. Something you did in 2017, you won't do in 2018, lol. A lot, ah, like a lot. A lot. <laughs> there is so much I could say to this question <laughs> because, oh boy, 2017 was the year of learning. Like learning and seeing just everything for its true colors, I guess. Like I like to give people the benefit of the doubt, but I've realized not everyone deserves it. So I'm gonna be really careful with like who I trust this year and things like that. And, like I'm just tired of getting hurt and thinking about like, stuff that I don't need to think about and takes up so much of like my mind space but like in five years like it really won't matter and I'm like what am I doing? I want to leave that aspect of like overthinking about people and situations and things that I literally cannot change. One thing you want to accomplish this year. One thing I really want to accomplish that I don't want to talk too much about because I don't want to jinx it slash give too much away but stuff around fashion and clothing and me putting it out 
for other people. <laughs> like not merch, but you'll see. I have such a clear vision in mind and I want to make it a reality and I'm working really hard right now to do so. So stay tuned, I'm really excited to work on all the stuff that I've been wanting to work on and finally can. I just want 2018 to be like a grind year. Like I wanna be grinding. Someone asked, what's one thing you left in 2017? By the way, I love you and I love you too. Something I left in 2017, I guess people that I've just finally seen their true colors and I don't vibe with it or the part of me that cared too much. I guess, you know, I want to care for people in a healthy way and not in a way that like destroys you emotionally. That's multiple things I left in 2017 and I'm hoping 2018 is our year, the best year. <clears throat> I need a cough drop. Oh my God. What are your thoughts on the whole Logan Paul situation and do you have any advice for someone who has been affected by this kind of situation? Love you. And I love you too. And I don't want to talk a lot about Logan Paul because I just don't want to even bring attention to this whole situation. The one piece of advice I could give to Logan would be to delete his channel. Honestly, because that fool's made enough money. He's not even in YouTube for the right reasons. You can just tell in his videos. It's like that video made me sick to my stomach. The only thing I could say about that is nobody who has a heart could put that video out. I don't know. Suicide is a scary, scary f topic. It's scary. It's sad. It's not something to joke about whatsoever. It's not something to even mention like that in a video. Like just... I don't know. You can't take that lightly. By whom you got your name? Oh, this girl got good grammar. And then she said, is there a chance you could DM me? And yes, of course, I got you after I filmed this. My grandpa gave me my name, um, the one that I want to get a tattoo in honor of. He named me Melody Joy. So shout out grandpa for my name. What do you want to change in your life in 2018? I think this is going to be the last question just because, I don't know, I like ending on like a positive note and I personally want 2018 to be the most positive year for me. And just, you know, everyone, like the people I love and the, the world, the world needs positivity at this point. Oh my God. I honestly really just want to like live my life, see different places, just see more of the world and kind of get out of my little bubble of where I am every day. You feel me? I don't know. There's a lot I want to do in 2018. My camera's about to die. And I think I answered a pretty good amount of questions. So I hope you guys enjoyed this Q&A and got to see what was going on in my life, what's new. Just a little personal time with moi. <laughs> Who am I? My voice sounds terrible, what is happening? Um, I'm gonna go, but I love you guys to infinity and beyond. I mean it when I say it and I hope you know that. And I hope you're having a marvelous morning, afternoon, or night. <laughs> and I'll hopefully see your beautiful face in my next video. <laughs> Deuces B, I love you. I take a nap right now. See, energy, this is like, ah. I know a lot of people hate on me for drinking energy drinks, but this one has vitamins, so it's okay. <laughs> mm -mm. Adulting is hard, bro.